I really put the work in. Like, then you got to think, I'm older than all the other rappers, but I'm 33, so my fan base is yes. the people I grew up with in 30 and up club, bro. Yeah. So the people 25 and up, they ain't even, you know what I'm saying? And I don't really do drill music, bro. That's like, yeah. That's like some police shit, really, bro. Really? Like, especially if you really got some shit going on. It's like if you sold weed and you steady rapping about selling weed, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> This is like yeah. This is you crazy. can't okay. Let's come on. Let's let's address the elephant in the room, bro. What's the elephant in the room? Like me and you had a conversation, bro, years ago. Sure Cap was trying to get signed, bro. Years to, ago. To, to me? Yeah, I was like, bro. I was like, let me let me tap in. I think uh, what the Broski Bryson or whatever his name was. He was like, bro. Uh, I, I'm on with P Nice right now. And we trying to get to. Oh, it. are you, you talking about? You talking about uh? Bryson Hefner? Yeah, bro. Do, do you feel like like signing is even good? And how you feel about like not necessarily missing out on a shirt cap uh, I, I'm sign, a, but I'm, I'm gonna put it to you like this, bro. This rap shit is different, bro. It's like yeah. you got talented niggas that can sing and like you got your Rod Waves, Mo Three. Yeah. Then you got niggas like Young Dog, Filthy Rich. Right. Who image sales and then music sales, bro. Yeah. So like, niggas who in the cell, you got to put a real bag up. Yeah. Niggas who's talented, you ain't got to put no bag up because they're going to drop a hit that's going to sell itself. Type shit. So, who your top five in Tulsa? i hit you with this quick. Uh, my top five in the town yeah. right now? Town, Tulsa. Ooh. Keep it a hundred. You might not listen to the younger generation. You, I don't know if you about to say Steph Simon and a bunch of other people. Bro, I ain't never heard a Steph Simon song in my life, bro. <laughs> <laughs> who is that? <laughs> You laughing, bro? Who is Steph Simon? Bro, stop the cap, bro. Bro, for real, who is Steph Simon? Oh my God, he's a Tulsa dude. He even got a blue check now, I think. Yeah, I don't bro, know if he bought it. Ten dollars, though, bro. <laughs> I don't pay attention to that, bro. No disrespect to Steph Simon. I ain't throwing no shade at you, bro. I don't know you, bro. So you know what he, I'm saying? I think he around your age, like he a, he thirty in no club. Bro, bro, I, bro, I listen to trap shit, though, bro. So I, so who your top five? Come my, on, my top five. I need to hear. What we going off of, bro? We Tell going me. off of what you typing in your shit right now. No, Tulsa. No bullshit, bro. I'm going to listen to Jagged Edge while I listen to a Tulsa rapper, bro. This is what it is, bro. I don't listen to nobody from the town, bro. But I, I know niggas that rap, so I'll give you a top five right now. But Stop I, capping. Bro. Who your top five, bro? I need to pull out my history on YouTube, bro. I don't listen to them niggas. My top five got to be this, though. Here go my top five, bro. I'll put nigga Mike the Don in there. Okay. I put Honcho in there. Okay. OTS? Yeah. Okay. OTS. I put a little DZ in there. Ooh, baby DZ. Yeah, baby DZ. She go crazy. Yeah, bro. I gotta get her interview. <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, so weird. I, I got little DZ. Yeah. I got D and Ten. Okay. And I got double K, bro. Okay. That's my top five. I thought he was gonna leave <laughs> DDL. He put D and T with both DD too. That's legendary. But but that's just yeah, that's you. I gotta, but I don't listen to talk yeah. about yeah, yeah. Because I feel like I'm not a part of that rap scene, bro. They don't fuck with me like that, bro. Why do you feel like nobody fuck with you, bro? Man, bro, I, I be hitting niggas up. They talk about a thousand dollars, bro. They ain't even got a music video <laughs> like that, bro. Like, like, like make it how do you, sense. How do you feel about the Tulsa rappers charging like $400 for features, bro? Bro, that's crazy because y'all ain't even making no money off of it, bro. So, like, that's like me telling you I'm charging him 400 for a bag of weed that he can't even sell. I mean, like, I mean, make it make sense, bro. Yeah. You, you want to get paid for this shit. That should be your ultimate goal. Bro. Yeah. I mean, I don't charge. Like, if a nigga hit me for a feature, it's free. Yeah. And I'm going to put four, five hundred that you was going to pay me uh -huh. into the marketing. Uh -huh. uh, YouTube, say cheese, wherever it's going to go. Uh -huh. So we can get a bag for it, bro. Yeah. But niggas ain't even like, I, I, didn't, I didn't buy features from niggas. I know I ain't never made a dollar off this rap shit. Type bro. shit. So that's just like, I just gave away some money because... Niggas, and then they might not even want to rap next year. Or I mean, I'm just keeping it hunting, Type right? shit. I got songs with niggas who don't even want to do the video. So how many people didn't want to do this video, bro? I, like nine. I since nine? I started, since 2019. Nine, nine people, niggas. you bought features and they didn't want to do the... Why Why you feel like, damn, you that hated, bro? Nah, it, it's like this, bro. If you get caught what did you do? me... It's like if you get caught fucking with that nigga, you can't fuck with us type shit. You know what I'm saying? So I think that's what it really is, though. It's, it's in you getting blackballed right now by bro, by bro. a certain artist think, or bro. something, bro? I came out and said, fuck everybody, so I'm pretty sure I am blackballed, bro. Yeah. <laughs> okay, bro.